Call of Duty World War II. We need to speak about this because, you know, this is big news. We're going to talk about today, as you can see, original BO2 Cutcom. Uh, we're here, back again. It's It's been a while since I've actually been on this game. I've played it a bit, and oh boy, uh, I miss it. But what we need to talk about today is Call of Duty World War II. Now, the biggest thing, you know, the biggest point right now is that it is boots on the ground. That's why everybody's pretty much hyped about it, and there was tons of speculation about if this was, like, actually true, and I actually thought it was, like, fake, like, that, like, and then all of a sudden, you know, and it's just kind of actually really weird that it's actually, like, actually, uh, what the fuck got on here? That's an actual thing that's gonna happen. But the number one thing about Call of Duty World War II is that it's boots on the ground, and now, obviously, that's getting everybody hyped. I mean, as you can literally go onto the trailer and see the, the likes and, like, the views amount that it's got, it, it's just, it, in comparison to, like, any other Call of Duty trailer recently, why is this kid B2 Free Army? It is done phenomenally like well but the second part as well is that you know nazi zombies is uh coming back as well to this and i think it's going to be corp as well i have no idea something along the lines of that or maybe that's just a campaign but there's a little backstory actually to this because you know i think the last time there was uh nazi zombies was uh world at war obviously so years back i got world at war on ps2 hoping now i did know there was going to be like zombies on it and i played the whole game i played the whole campaign because i thought you had to play the whole campaign as i like remember in order to play zombies i literally bought it for zombies and there wasn't any zombies now nah, it's just i'm not even going to talk about it, but that was just a complete letdown and probably the other huge thing is that sledgehammer now if you know who sledgehammer are, they made well, they helped make one offer free and one offer free was amazing now another like drawback actually to that they did do advanced warfare so uh, and that didn't you know quite go uh, down as well so you know it's kind of a 50 50 chance you know of if this will do well or you not know, you know it probably most likely will do well but hopefully it lives up to its height bo3 beta i think i did that i think i oh yeah infinite warfare beta i did that but the fourth point is that there's going to be a private beta to it i don't know if there will be but maybe an open like a open like beta hopefully now obviously to get the private beta you kind of need to pre so I probably will I got you before you could see for me right okay never mind oh three kills last no no why would so those are just gonna be four things just talking about World War two there because you know this is kind of you know I've pretty much got every single uh, cod up to it and I, it's like 50 50 I should even bother uh, you know purchasing it or not but tell me down below in the comments if you will be purchasing or pre-ordering or you know I'm looking forward to playing the beta Off, off, that's not happening.